Hello, Starfish community, and welcome back to another World Dance Console video. So, in this video, I'm going to be driving the Leopard 2 AV on No Man Hunt. Yeah, this is No Man Hunt. So, this is an old replay that I've, I've, I've. English? I've had for a while. Apparently, I was going to do a video on the Leopard 2 AV when it first came out, but I never did one. Basically, when all three of the Leopards came out, the Leopard 1A1, the Leopard VT2, and the Leopard 2AV. Which is weird, I never did a video on the Leopard 2AV, which is by far the my favorite of the three premium Leopards. Because it has the mobility, it has really good armor, and it has the great gun that the Leopard 1A1 has. But it has the mobility and heavy tank-like armor. Because it is, out of the three leopards, it is the heavy tank. Now, since the replay is so old, I don't actually know what equipment and cruise skills I was running in during this replay. So, yeah. Also, if you end up liking this video, consider subscribing because it's free. And it helps out the channel a ton. So, yeah. The Leopard 2 AV. Very good gun. Very good mobility. And stuff like that. So... Yes, this is a heavy tank, but it's one of the fastest heavy tanks in the game. So this tank goes 72.5 kilometers forward and 31 reverse speed with a power to weight ratio of 26.35. If I didn't tell you this was a heavy, you would think those were light tank stats. If I just read those stats off, you would think this is a light tank or a very fast medium tank. Now the heavy tank with strong frontal armor. And that can ram. And it also has a really good gun. So let's talk about the gun. 3,284 DPM. 460 damage per shot. Penetration is really good. 362 in standard. And 430 on its premium. And if you want to fire your high explosive, 230 high explosive accuracy is great at 0.33. And aim time is 1.9 seconds. And you have 9 degrees of gun pressure. What else? Speed of the ammo is really quickly at 1,455 for its standard and 1,173 on its premium. Anything else I want to say about this tank? Um, view, view range is 470 meters. Obviously, camo sucks because it's a heavy tank. But dang. So... Yeah, I find this very interesting that I was going to make a video on the Leopard 2 AV when this tank first came out, but never did. Got a replay up for it and everything. And you can tell how old this replay is because of how puny the smoke is and where the ammunition is put on the tank, like on the HUD. Also, that is a flipped over tank. So... Yeah, that's a flipped over T92. You can also see the shells. Yes, this is a bot match, but it does feature the Leopard 2 AV. I don't snipe for the entire match. I just snipe for a little bit, then I go out there, use my mobility, and use my armor. But, it's pretty much how you want to play the Leopards. You want to snipe for a good, be a good decent while? Because you have the gun to do it. You have pretty good accuracy, great penetration, and great damage then when it's time use your mobility in this case use your mobility and armor also this leopard 2 av actually has the most hit points of any era 2 tank at 3100 and yeah this is just the leopard 2 av just sniping using the incredible gun that the leopard 1a1 has and but also having the armor that the Leopard 2 AV has. So it's basically like a Leopard 1A1 and the Leopard VT2 merged into one to create the Leopard 2 AV. Also, this is like a, two, a Leopard 2A5 era 2. So, yeah, that's what you're playing. Which is weird because... This was the least popular Leopard between the three premium tanks. So, yeah, it's quite weird. But it's still a really, really good Leopard. I don't really like Leopards, but this one, I do enjoy. 
with uh, you equip this with mobility and controlled impact, you can do really, really good ramming potential in this tank. And it's just fun. <laughs> it really is just fun. Just ramming people to death. Using your mobility. And just ramming them. So far, I'm just trying to peek over this. I think this is like one of my first matches in the Leopard 2 AV. So that's why I'm kind of a little bit struggling right here, but it's fine. I've done 8,000 damage, 660 block. And yeah, and snapshotting some shots along the way. After all this time of having the Leopard 2 AV, I've still had the same opinions. It's still a great tank with great mobility, great armor, and decent gun. My thoughts on this tank has not changed. And yeah, it's, if you have the chance to pick it up and you like your leopards, especially your Arrow 3 leopards, you'll definitely like this leopard. Because it's like a, like I said before, a leopard 2A5 at Arrow 2. So yeah, right here, I'm just trying to focus these three tanks. And as you can see, I'm actually pretty decently winning against them. This Mobat's staying lower, low against me, so he can't. Act. I can't actually shoot him, but I could shoot the T72 and the uh, M60 that's all the way over there. M60 bounces off me, and I'm going to put a shot in this T72, but turns into the Mobat, so I can kill the Mobat. And do I get to? Nope, I do not get to shoot the T72, but I do in this match on 10,000. 709 damage. I mean, 10,779 damage, 4 kills, 708,000 silver made, and still a really, really good tank. Anyway, that's it for this video. Remember, like, comment, subscribe. Also, remember to subscribe fish because watch that. And peace out. See ya.